are here in North Manchester and Boggart Hole Clough um, for this commemoration event of the work of the suffragettes. The suffragettes have paved the way for uh, women to have a legal identity. A hundred years ago, women um, didn't have any status at all and the suffragettes worked courageously with real bravery, um, met in this place where we, where we are today to plan how to make changes in, in Parliament. Um, and so we're here to uh, commemorate and celebrate that um, and to give thanks and perhaps to think about um, what next as well, has, how we continue to make sure that we have a voice um, and that we are heard um, as part of all what it means to be in, uh, in society and in the church as well. Our Mother's Union branch wanted to do something to celebrate the 100 years of women's suffrage. And it so happened that we had a local Littleborough person who had campaigned for women's suffrage and for a no number of feminist and socialist causes all her life. On our banner, we have the wonderful Reverend Canon Dr. Uh, Rachel Mann, who is, of course, our vicar at St. Uh, Nick's. And we decided that we wanted to represent as many women as possible. So we've put just names of all sorts of women who are currently in the church, who have been in the church, uh, and who have just been important in the church's history. It's been a real um, blessing. We've had the sunshine. We've had lots of people who have come with banners and colors those suffragette colours of, of purple um, signifying dignity, the white signifying purity, and the green signifying hope. And so we've walked around the lake, that was our first activity together, an um, opportunity to chat about um, the suffragettes and to just get to know each other a bit more. And then we stopped for this Thanksgiving service um, to recommit ourselves um, to working towards hope um, for the contribution of, of women in all spheres really, in, in arts, commerce, the church um, and of course politics.